Hello and welcome back to the Coder Shop channel. In today's video, we're going to take a closer look at product documents in Odoo 18. This feature lets you upload and attach documents to your products, giving customers detailed information in a visually engaging way before they make a purchase. This not only enhances the shopping experience, but also builds trust and ensures transparency. Now let's jump into Odoo and see it in action. First, let's open the sales app, navigate to products, and open the customizable task product form. Inside the form, we'll select the documents tab at the top, which takes us to the documents page for this product. This is where we can view all related files. Since no documents are uploaded yet, let's add one. And actually, we've got two ways to do this. First, we can click new to open the product document form. Here we have a few options. If the document is stored externally, we can just paste the URL. If it's a PDF, image, or any other file, we can upload it directly from the computer. There is also a dynamic fields option that allows us to include dynamic product info. Great for personalized quotations. We will cover that in another video. Now let's talk about documents visibility options. We can keep the document private, so only we see it. We can make it visible when a quotation is created. It can show up after the order is confirmed. Or we can attach it directly to the quotation PDF sent to the customer. For e-commerce visibility, we can check the Publish on Website option to make it downloadable from the product page. And lastly, on the manufacturing, we can link it to the bill of materials. So it appears as an attachment when this product is part of a BOM. All right, that's one way to do it, but now let's look at the faster way to upload documents. So all we have to do is click upload right here. I've already got the document ready for our customizable desk. So let's select it, upload, and there it is. Odoo instantly creates a card for the document. Now we can adjust its visibility and decide if you want to publish it on the website. For this example, I'll set it to on quote and toggle publish on website. Now let's see this in action. I'm going to create a new quotation with this product. First, I select a customer who wants to buy our customizable desk. Here they can choose product variants or add additional products, but I'll just confirm it as is and click save. Now when we click on the preview button, we can see the quotation and right there, our product document. Clicking on it automatically downloads the file so we can see all the product details. Let's also check it on the website. If we go to the product page, we can see our document is available for customers to download with just one click. Let's open it up. And there it is. All the detailed product info giving customers a closer look before they make a purchase. This way they get the best and most informed shopping experience. And that's it. Now we know how to upload, configure, and manage product documents in Odoo 18. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more Odoo tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.